Hello bows and bombshells and welcome to the channel. My name is Janae Jackson from hellobombshell.com and in this try on haul, I'm taking you to Zara. If you saw my last Zara haul, which I'll make sure to link up here for you guys, then you know I love spring and summer collections and I love bold and vibrant colors. So I'm super excited for the pieces that I picked up this trip to Zara in Miami. I got some beautiful textured fabrics, I got some linen, I got some satin looks to show you guys, as well as some bold, vibrant colors, and some really exotic, fun prints. These looks are gonna be perfect if you're going on vacation, if you're dating and you need some date night looks, or if you just need some casual, you know, really cute looks for going out or for day to day. Let's go ahead and get into it and I'm going to show you all of these looks. So here we have this gorgeous, gorgeous two-piece set. The top is in a satin material and the skirt is in like a polyester material. But the, as you can see, the fabric, the print of the fabric does match perfectly. And it's like a green and yellow kind of mash up with bits of pink and green and here it does have this black and white detail and it's just such a beautiful elegant ethnic look i feel like i'm wearing a kimono slash dashiki slash sari it's just so many cultural influences in one look and i am totally totally here for it this is something that would be perfect for a casual date night or a night out on the town with the girls. Definitely just a vibrant eye-catching look that is sure to turn heads and get you lots and lots of compliments. Love this. Oh, I really like this. This is very, very pretty. As you can see, this is a beautiful linen dress in this very natural color almost like a beige or you could describe it as a nude but definitely more of a natural beige color and it's just so so elegant so so classy and so my style like very simple yet chic and just has a very bohemian naturalist vibe. As you can tell from my hair, I'm definitely a free spirit at heart and this dress is giving free spirit mother earth vibes and I'm here for it. <laughs> so you can see here it has, it's in a linen material and then on the side it has this really gorgeous cut out that just add a little bit of sex appeal to this otherwise very modest and sophisticated look this is definitely perfect for vacation i actually would wear this out and about as well like if i'm running errands like going to the supermarket or going to the post office you know just like an everyday dress this is definitely going to be a great look as well so this dress does go down about mid-calf on me and then it has these really high slits on either side which gives it even more sex appeal. And then if we look at the back, it just zips up very simply in the back but the cut of it definitely accentuates your curves, especially your behind and your waist which just really makes it look very feminine and very gorgeous. I do feel as if the straps are a little bit loose on me. You can see that they can very easily fall down, but that's a very, very easy fix to be made. You can do it yourself or you can take it to a seamstress who can just, you know, pin the straps and make them so that they fit you perfectly. It's giving me Pocahontas, naturalist, empress vibes and i am here for it so here we have this gorgeous gorgeous satin dress in this beautiful tropical print with all of these bold and vibrant colors and this is absolutely perfect 
first of all I love a good dress I feel like a dress is just so easy to wear you just throw it on pair it with a purse and a pair of heels or sandals or even a pair of sneakers and you're good to go you don't have to worry about coordinating a top and a bottom I love the crisscross detail that this has in the front on the top it just really adds a uh, level of sex appeal that's just very classy and feminine and then here on the bottom i love this high high slit that's just giving a whole lot of leg but not too much just enough not too much <laughs> in the back it does tie in a little bow here and then zip up on the bottom and then you just take the front piece crisscross it around your neck and tie it just in the back and if you want you don't have to crisscross it you can just tie it up like this so you wouldn't have this cross right in the front but i feel like the cross in the front just gives it a little bit more sex appeal which we're always here for a little extra sexiness <laughs> no, i mean <laughs> and yeah i love this dress super gorgeous i feel very pretty very comfortable and very girly in this dress here we have another earthy naturalista bohemian vibe outfit that i love both the top and the bottom are in a gorgeous gorgeous linen material and the skirt is in this really beautiful olive green the top in a very natural but a darker brown than in the dress i tried on earlier and the first thing i notice about the top is that it fits a little bit bigger than i had hoped i do believe it's either a small or an extra small the details will be in the description below um, but i think what i would do is i would actually have to take this top in so that it actually fits me a little bit more fitted and it's not gaping in the front or in the back so I just took an elastic and tied it in the back just to give you guys an idea of how I hoped that it would fit with this skirt I think if the top were to fit like this it would really just kind of bring the outfit together a lot better I think that looks really nice and beautiful and the skirt pairs with it perfectly it's not matchy matchy which I love monochromatic I love being all in one color or even things just matching a little bit more but I'm here for the coordinating you know we're going with earth tones brown and green they definitely go together and definitely flow together well in this outfit the skirt is in an extra small so when I pull it up on my waist which is quite small it fits perfectly I probably would want to do something with this as well maybe just tack it so that it falls a little bit like that or maybe actually I think it's fine I would keep the top just like that and if I turn around, you can see the back of the skirt. It definitely fits really nicely. I appreciate that, Zara, that the waist fits smaller and then it fits my butt, it fits my hips, and it really accentuates my shape really very well. This look is perfect for a brunch. It's perfect for a dinner. You can dress it up, you can dress it down. You can definitely wear this with sandals if you're on vacation somewhere tropical and because of the material you're definitely going to be kept cool and because of the style of the skirt you very you're going to look very chic and very elegant really really love this look the next look we have here is this blue and white dress and this dress is also in a light linen material and as you can see it's very patterned and it looks to me very tropical but maybe like a polynesian kind of tropical very very pretty love the royal blue because i think royal blue is such a bold color that looks great on any skin tone i love that it's a wrap dress a wrap dress is just so elegant 
and so feminine and you just tie it right here on the side pop your collar fix yourself up and you're good to go this you could definitely wear during the day depending on where you are for example if you're here in miami this is definitely going to be a cute look for the nighttime too just throw this on with a pair of heels and pair it with a really gorgeous accessory and you are good to go this is really really cute here we have a pair of high-waisted jeans with this gorgeous turquoise color in this very soft material i don't know what kind of material you would call this it's close to a satin but it's not quite a satin and this is just such a cute outfit the color is really really popping and the jeans really fit phenomenally i don't think i've ever owned a pair of zara jeans because typically these fast fashion brands their jeans never fit me they're either too short because i'm tall or they don't fit my butt but i am really really shocked and surprised pleasantly so that these jeans actually fit me they fit me on the waist i mean there's a little bit of gapping here but that should be easy to fix either with a belt or i can take it to a seamstress and it fits my butt i do have to say that these are kind of like mom jeans and they're not the stretchy type of jean material so i don't think my butt looks great in them but it's you know it's like the 80s look before jeggings and and skinny jeans where jeans were super super tight so i mean my butt doesn't look bad but it's not a form-fitting jean that really is going to accentuate your curves but i'm not mad at it i think it still looks really nice it's giving mom jean vibes and paired with this top i think it really kind of elevates the whole look and just makes it look a lot dressier this is a top that you can pair with any kind of bottom because it's like a crop top so any kind of high-waisted bottom is going to go really really well with this top and it's just very sexy very fun this is definitely a great top to go out at night or i wouldn't necessarily wear this out in the daytime i mean maybe for brunch like a fun event or something like that but it's definitely a very dressy material and then the ruching here also gives it a dressy appeal overall i love the top and i really really like the jeans and i think they look really nice together what do you guys think so here we are in this blue satin number and wow this color is so bold and so vibrant i love the color i'm not sure how i feel about this style to me this is giving me bridesmaid vibe you know like a bridesmaid dress even though it's short it's just about mid calf just below the knee with this slit on the side I don't know it's just giving me a wedding party and I'm not really feeling it I love the color though the color is absolutely gorgeous and I'm just wondering if I maybe paired it with some different accessories that it would kind of tone down the the bridesmaid vibe I don't know this probably is my least favorite of the bunch but perhaps my favorite color i think the color and the fabric is phenomenal i really like the style as well but i think with the color and the material and the style all together it's just i'm not really feeling it tell me down in the comments what do you guys think i can tell you what i do like about this dress which is how it looks in the back zara these zara pieces are really snatching like they're really fit they're really made to fit a woman's body which i can appreciate very very much in the past or a lot of fast fashion brands i don't know who they made they're close to fit but typically they just don't 
fit like they're supposed to fit you know what i mean but these dresses have been fitting really really nicely like i don't feel like i would have to take this in or anything like that i mean it does have a little bit more fabric than i would like in the front but it's not bad love the cutouts love the details let me show you guys the back love the crisscross in the back as you can see it comes up quite high before that crisscross but either way just because of the way that it fits me and these cutout details in the side it also gives a lot of cleavage it's just a very overall very very sexy dress but i'm gonna be honest with you guys it's not my favorite of this haul what do you guys think the next look in this zara spring haul is this two-piece skirt and top set which i really love the colors i really adore the prints but i don't think i love these two things together i'm not even sure if they're supposed to be worn together but i don't think it looks good because here we have a high-waisted kind of skirt with a wrap detail and it looks like a skirt you know from the front but from the back you can see it's quite short also that it's a pair of shorts and you can see that here as well now when you pair it with this top it covers the high waist so the waist that it creates you lose it completely as well as it covers the the wrap detail so i don't think they're supposed to be paired together it would be really cute if the top was a little bit more fitted to show off the detail of the squirt. But even so, I, I'm not really liking this one as much as I thought I was going to. I think this top would look really beautiful with a pair of jeans. And I feel like this squirt would look really cute with a different top. But together, they're not doing it. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to throw on the pair of jeans that I tried on earlier with the top and then maybe I can try this skirt with one of the tops that I have yet to try on and see if those are going to look better together. But what do you guys think of this particular outfit? So here we have this purple two-piece set and I love a two-piece set y'all. Love a two-piece set. And this one is giving clueless vibes, a little bit of clueless vibes with this little crop jacket and a skirt for the bottom. In the front, it does look like a skirt, but when you turn around, you can see that is it's a really sexy short pair of shorts, really, really short. I mean, like my booty cheeks are popping out on the bottom but i think that is real cute you know real cute <laughs> and love that the sleeves are long enough that's really really important for girls with long arms you know what i'm saying and you could wear a different top under the jacket me i don't have any top no bra nothing underneath but i definitely think that you could style it with a really cute maybe a bodysuit or something like that underneath or you can just wear it solo dolo like i am right now and i think it looks good like this i kind of would have liked if it had pockets and as i'm reaching for the pockets that are not there you can see that if you're going to be moving around with this the top is also going to be moving around with you and if you're going to put your arms up you got to be careful because you're going to be spilling out on the bottom here and it's not very comfortable when you start to move your arms around so if you're going to be going out dancing or somewhere where you're going to be not just you know standing like this you definitely want to be able to unbutton this by having something underneath it and it's just gonna be a little jacket that you throw on top. But maybe if you're going out for dinner, you know you're gonna be just doing some tiny dainty movements. I think that wearing it without a top is gonna be just fine. Just to make sure that button is secure, honey, because it's only one button. One button and if it comes loose, you know what I'm saying? It's, 
it's gonna be a revolution <laughs> love the color love the two-piece set very very cute where would i wear this this is kind of a tricky outfit of where to wear you could wear this out for dinner for sure definitely wear it out for drinks definitely out to a party where you want to look fashion you know you want to look stylish it's definitely definitely a look and i'm here for it what do you guys think so here is one of the last outfits from zara and i think i totally missed the mark when i chose these pieces and when i put them together because this don't look good this don't look good <laughs> uh, i saw this skirt and i loved it in the store i love a boho vibe kind of anything a dress a skirt and i just thought this was a really unique skirt when i saw it in the store and i still think it is but when i put it on i don't think it really does anything for me at all like at all at all <laughs> yeah this skirt is not hitting like i thought it was gonna hit i also thought it was gonna be like a high waist vibe and it's just not giving that it's not giving that and then paired i thought it was gonna look good with this top because i figure you know it's a white top it's kind of neutral and it will go with anything and uh, yeah fail fail on that on that estimation it does not look good together i don't even like the top by itself i mean i got a little bit of makeup here just ignore that but um yeah i don't like the top i don't like the skirt i don't like them together this outfit is a flop there's another bottom that i want to try this top on with hopefully it will look a lot better um i'll still show off this outfit in case you like any of the pieces but i think both of these pieces are a flop so here is the other bottom that i thought about pairing this top with and i think alone by itself these shorts are super cute it's like a very indian inspired fabric and style with these really beautiful shiny details it's a pink color with orange details all throughout and it's just really really beautiful and really really vibrant it also fits beautifully it's high-waisted and it really fits me in the waist and fits me in the butt and the hips as well but I don't like it with this top I don't know what I was thinking I really missed the mark with this top it doesn't fit well it's not flattering it's uncomfortable and it doesn't look good at all but i think this pair of shorts will actually look good with another top i just have to figure out what top that's gonna be because it's definitely not gonna be this one all right here we have the very first dress from this zara spring haul and you can see it's this strapless kind of a scrunchy bodycon-esque but not quite bodycon dress and honestly when i saw this dress in the zara store i don't really feel like it looks like something zara would typically carry this is definitely i feel like zara definitely carries more contemporary more modern styles and this is very girly very feminine and so I was surprised to see it in Zara. And I have to say, I love the colors. I love the print. I love the style of the dress. Although I'm not really a fan of strapless, I still like the style of the dress. Um, I do feel like it could fit a little snugger. That is something that I perhaps maybe can get taken in by a seamstress i think that would really make this dress pop because otherwise it does fit a little bit loose in the waist area but this is such a beautiful flirty dress that is quintessentially spring beautiful colors beautiful print and just very feminine and girly 
it's just the fit I just would want it to fit me a little bit tighter and uh, but overall I think I really like this dress it's an easy date night outfit you know it's romantic you just throw this on and go definitely definitely a look definitely a vibe tell me what you guys think about this one there you have it this beautiful floral print dress brings this zara haul to a close if you enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe and give it a thumbs up tell me down in the comments which one was your favorite look and if you want to see more videos from me or more content from me make sure to check out the other videos on this channel as well as my fashion and lifestyle blog where i talk about all things lifestyle personal development fashion money making money make sure to check out my blog hellobombshell.com and i'll see you in the next video